objective objection to the transfer of money. Uh, I would respectfully disagree because Act 33 has been touched many times over the years since it was established. There have been bills that have been introduced, back like Senator Ingram introduced one in 2011 that said that money that is not recertified can be placed back with the intergovernmental affairs to be redistributed in that county. Uh, based upon the records that I've checked, that law has not been implemented. The one thing I would like everybody at the table also to know is that you haven't heard any pushback from the county judges because the county judge and the pilot program that will be selected will be the point of contact to help bring together a cohesive effort of all the fire departments to work collectively as a county to get the ISO rating down. Um, so that's one thing. Also, the Volunteer Fire Chiefs Association is supportive of this because they know that GIF money is going away. So we can either leave them hung out to dry or we can say, look, we're going to take a portion of this money, which is taxpayer money, I might remind everybody, and use it in order to help develop a pilot program that can be used as a model to systematically move across the state. That is the intent, the purpose, and the reason the bill is written. Um, with regards to Kendall, uh, God forbid something happens to Kendall, some are going to have to come in and figure out how to do Act 833 money, keep your money flowing to your volunteer fire departments. He's already struggling to keep up with the paperwork of a thousand fire departments. This would bring a cohesive approach to deal with it, and it is not touching any general surplus money. It was taxpayer money that was given for the purpose of helping fire departments help the citizens of the state of Arkansas. And with that, I would appreciate the good vote, Madam Chair, members of the committee. Thank you. Pleasure committee. Motion to